السلام علیکم ڈیئر اسٹوڈنٹس دس از انٹرنیشنل اسلامک یونیورسٹی اسلام آباد اسکول ساہیوال کیمپس قرآنک گریڈ فور یونٹ نمبر فور لیکچر نمبر ون لیسن نمبر تھرٹین مورل ٹیچنگس آف اسلام اسٹوڈنٹس برنگ یو قرآنک بک اینڈ نوٹ بک اوپن دیم and write date, date, topic and index properly. Listen to your teacher attentively. Mark all the important points said by your teacher on your book. The topic that we are going to discuss in moral teachings of Islam is kindness. Allah commands us to be kind. If we are kind to others, Allah will be kind to us. کائنڈنس کا مطلب ہے دوسروں کے ساتھ رحم دلی سے پیش آنا اینڈ دس از ون آف دا بگیسٹ کمانڈمنٹس آف اللہ ٹو دا مسلمس دیٹ یو شوڈ بی کائنڈ ٹو ادرس اینڈ اللہ ول بی کائنڈ ٹو یو اللہ از کائنڈ اینڈ مرسی فل کائنڈنس اینڈ مرسی فل آر فرام دا موسٹ بیوٹیفل ایٹیبیوٹس آف اللہ دیٹ اللہ از کائنڈ اینڈ آلسو مرسی فل and he commands the muslims to be kind and merciful to one another so allah ne apni sifat jo ke rehm dili aur meherbani se pesh aana hai muslimano ko bhi is baat ka aur puri insaniyat ko is baat ka hukm diya ke wo dusron ke sath rehm dili se pesh aaye if we are kind to others allah will be kind to us agar hum dusron ke sath rehm dili se pesh aate hain to allah bhi hamare sath rehm dili se pesh aayenge the prophet sallallahu alaihi wa alihi wasallam said You should be kind to those who are on the earth. The one in the heaven, that is Allah, will be kind to you. Aan sallallahu alayhi wa alayhi wa sallam ne irshad farmaya ki tum un logon par rahem farmao. Tum un logon par rahem karo jo zameen par hain. To Allah jo ke aasman mein hain, tum par rahem karega. Kindness is the quality of good Muslims and commands of Allah. Rahem dili. مسلمان کی بہترین صفات میں سے ایک ہے اور اللہ کے احکامات میں سے ایک حکم یہ ہے کہ دوسروں کے ساتھ رحم دلی سے پیش آیا جائے دا پروفٹ صلی اللہ علیہ وآلہ وسلم ٹولڈ مسلم ٹو بی کائنڈ ٹو ایوری ون نوٹ اونلی ٹو مسلمس بٹ آلسو ٹو دا نان مسلم دا جیوز دا کرسچنز اینڈ دا ہندوز آپ صلی اللہ علیہ وسلم نے اللہ کے اس احکام کو واضح فرماتے ہوئے کہا مسلمان کو چاہیے کہ وہ تمام تر لوگوں کے ساتھ رحم دلی سے پیش آئے چاہے وہ غیر مسلم ہوں یہودی ہوں عیسائی ہوں یا ہندو ہوں اللہ تعالیٰ نے تمام تر انسانوں کو دوسرے تمام انسانوں کے لیے رحم دلی سے پیش آنے کا حکم دیا دا پروفٹ صلی اللہ علیہ وآلہ وسلم سیڈ کائنڈنس از ناٹ ٹو بی فاؤنڈ ان اینی تھنگ بٹ دیٹ اٹ ایڈس ٹو اٹس بیوٹی اینڈ اٹ از ناٹ ود جان فرام اینی تھنگ بٹ اٹ میکس اٹ ڈیفیکٹو آ صلی اللہ علیہ وآلہ وسلم کی حدیث ہے کہ رحم دلی کوئی ایسی چیز نہیں کہ جسے کسی بھی چیز میں شامل کیا جا سکے یا اس سے نکالا جا سکے بلکہ اگر یہ کسی انسان کے کردار میں موجود ہے تو اس کے کردار میں خوبصورتی پیدا کرتی ہے اور اگر یہ اس کے کردار میں موجود نہ ہو تو اس کے کردار کو ناقص بنا دیتی ہے دا مورل ٹیچنگ دیٹ دس کانسیپٹ آف کائنڈنس اسٹیٹ از دیٹ One should respect other people. He should help the needy, look after the poor and the orphans. One should also be kind to animals. So the concept of kindness explains that a Muslim should not only be kind to the other people, not only to respect the other, look after the poor and the orphans, but also he should treat his servants and all those who work for him with kindness and overlook their mistakes a muslim should treat his servants and all the person that work under him and that work for him he should behave them with kindness and should overlook their mistakes and do not punish them muslim should also treat others with good manners muslim should also be kind to the animals so in the concept that muslim should also be kind to the animals here is exam here is an example stated that a woman was sent to hell because she locked a cat in and it died of hunger so on the page number 63 of your textbook the example stated that 
A woman was sent to hell because she locked a cat and it died of hunger. इस मिसाल में ये बताया गया है कि एक औरत ने एक बिल्ली को बांध दिया और वो बिल्ली भूख प्यास की वजह से मर गई तो उस औरत को अल्लाह ताला ने जहन्नुम में डाल दिया और ये वो रहम दिली है जिसकी वजह से जिसका होना इंसान के किरदार को बुलंद करता है और जिसका ना होना इंसान को जहन्नुम की तरफ ले जा सकता है वन स मैन वॉज वॉकिंग ऑन अ रोड ही बिकेम वेरी थर्सडी ही केम अक्रॉस अ वेल ही गोड डाउन इन टू इट एंड ड्रेंक वाटर वेन ही केम आउट He saw a dog panting and licking mud because of excessive thirst. The man went down the well again and filled his shoe with water and gave the dog to drink from it. Allah thanked him for that deed and forgave him. So in this example the concept of kindness is explained for the animals is explained very beautifully. This is example of a man that was walking on a road and he became very thirsty he came across a well he got down into it and drank the water at the main time at the same time a dog come and that is panting and licking mud because of the excessive thirst the man went down the well again and filled his shoe with water and gave to the dog to drink from it so allah thanked him for that deed and forgave him so this is basically the act of kindness that allah appreciated and forgave the person now we will do the exercise activity question answers question number 1 how will allah treat a person who is kind to others answer allah will be kind to a person who is kind to others our prophet sallallahu alaihi wa alihi wasallam also said you should be kind to those who are the on the earth the one in heaven allah will be kind to you question number 2 how can you show kindness to other people this question is about the show that how you will show kindness to other people explain the manners so the first one is that one should respect other people number 2 one should also be kind to the animals number 3 one should treat others with good manners number 4 one should also help the needy poor and look after the orphan so these are some manners by which you can show the kindness to the other people question number 3 why was the woman punished a woman was sent to hell because she locked a cat and it died of hunger you can find the answer of question number 3 on the page number 63 the point number 2 question number 4 narrate the story of a man and a thirsty dog so we have studied this full example on the page number 63 of quranic textbook the point third about the manners by which human beings can show kindness to their other persons to the other persons so the full example can be the answer of this question number 4 so once a man was walking on a road he became very thirsty he came across a well he go down into it and drank water when He came out he saw a dog panting and licking mud because of excessive thirst the man went down the well again and filled his shoe with water and gave the dog to drink from it allah thanked him for that deed and forgave him so this is answer of question number 4 question number 5 fill in the blanks with suitable words so you have to put suitable words to fill in these blanks the first blank is that a muslim should be respect other people help the needy dash dash the poor and the orphans so what we can place over here so we can place over here old persons and look after the orphans and poor that is point number 1 of the manners of the kindness number 2 a muslim should dash the mistakes of his servants he should overlook the mistake of his servants number 3 one should not be one should not use dash words or show dash to anyone one should not use bad words or show anger to anyone so this is solution of activity question number 1 till 5 okay students 
Uh, so, the main concept or the moral that lesson that we gain from this lesson is that we should be kind to others and we should behave with good manner with others so that we should add up a beautiful, a beautiful attribute to our character and it will enhance the beauty of our internal character and it will make us a good Muslim and we will have the good quality of a good Muslim that is kindness. So, as per the hadith of Rasul sallallahu alayhi wa alayhi wa sallam that Muslims must be kind to others and Allah will be kind to you that you should be kind to those who are on the earth and the one in heaven that is Allah will be kind to you. So, we can have the kindness of Allah if we be, the, if we be kind with others. So, this is the end of our lesson. You have to write down all the question answers of this lesson on your Quranic classic notebooks. Allah Hafiz.